you suck at breath holding and you know it. And I know why that is, so let's talk about this. First of all, you need to stop thinking about time. Every time you think about time, that's when you're not focused on the present moment. And holding your breath is all about being in the moment, being in that present moment and learning to understand what is going on inside of you. If you keep on looking at your computer, if you keep on thinking about how long you're gonna hold your breath, then you're messing up your internal process. You need to be focused, you need to be totally in peace and in the moment. Another reason that messes up your breath hold is when you want to prove yourself. Most people, they wanna prove themselves. They want to hold their breath for three minutes or two minutes or four minutes or whatever. So by holding their breath longer, they think they're gonna be more important or they think that other people would look at them as more important. <laughs> Nothing could be further from the truth because the reality is that no one gives a damn about how long you hold your breath only you do only you care how long you hold your breath but nobody else does so if you stop proving yourself then it's going to be so much easier to hold your breath because there is no pressure the pressure of trying to prove yourself is going to be gone so you can totally focus on yourself and on learning on how to hold your breath and the skills of breath holding instead of trying to be someone. And with that, of course, comes your ego. Now, lots of people have a big ego. Maybe even I have a big ego because after all, I'm a YouTuber, right? So try to minimize the impacts of your ego on your daily life and especially on your breath holding. Try to go into a breath hold without ego. If you let go of the ego, then there is no desired outcome anymore. There is no performance anxiety. There is no stress. There is nothing. Without ego, there is total peace. Go into a breath hold without ego and things will be so much easier. Now, when I ask people to hold their breath for a video or just for, for fun, I immediately can see that they're getting stressed. And when you're mentally stressed, that translates into physical stress. So if you go into a breath hold with stress, then obviously that's not gonna work. So how do you get rid of stress? Well, again, if there is no outcome, then there is no reason to be stressed. So you have to understand that all the stress, all the anxiety that you're feeling is you yourself who have been putting this upon yourself. It's not the other people. It's not the world that is putting stress upon yourself. It is you. You yourself are putting stress upon yourself and you have to find a way to get rid of this. Physically, you might want to do some stretching before, you might want to loosen up your muscles and mentally, you want to be in the best possible place. And some of those techniques we can use are called or, or under the umbrella of visualization techniques. So try to focus on one single thing, something that you enjoy thinking about. It can be whatever, it can be a song, it can be a food, it can be something uh, that happened in your childhood, it doesn't matter. Try to focus on one single thing so that there is no room for stress in here. There's only room for happy feelings and happy thoughts. Focus on one thing and the stress will go away. And last but not least, uh, see this happening with many people, they think life is a competition, it's not. I like to see it as a game. If you stop looking at life as a competition and you start looking at it as a game, then suddenly Everything is so much easier because the game is just a game. Who cares what's the outcome of a game? It doesn't matter. But if you look at it as a competition, oh God, you're gonna make things very difficult for yourself in life and in your breath hold. Look at everything you do in life besides a breath hold. Applying for a new job, starting to learn a new language, whatever it is. Look at it as a game. Stress will go away, anxiety will go away, and peace will come. Peace in every breath.